I'm a trustee with IPR because I really believe in the mission of the organization. I think it's just so critical to understand the science behind the art. And there are very few organizations that do that. There's so much talk about being creative, about understanding data analytics. And it's one thing to know how to do it. It's another thing to understand why we should do it and how to do it. In today's world, which is a very global world, um, it makes total sense for IPR to be uh, expanding uh, internationally. Uh, and certainly in Asia, where we're seeing uh, the rise of many new companies, many new MNCs that are Asian based, um, there's a great demand uh, for uh, more knowledge, more insights uh, into uh, communications, uh, into public relations and stakeholder engagement. Uh, and so I think there's a really important role for IPR to play uh, in helping uh, to guide the ongoing um, development of the, the public relations sector in regions like Asia. IPR is um, advocating on behalf of research, always has been. I think research has never been more critical to our industry and is driving every campaign uh, from every company. So to be a member of the on the cutting edge of research uh, is just an amazing blessing for me. So there's no question IPR is the future. Research is table stakes. So advocating and advancing the profession of research doesn't get any better. I see IPR as really quite unique. Um, it is an organization that focuses on the research for the profession that can be used by professionals in this, this industry. And when I speak to people in, in the communications industry, often um, they, are, they are really uh, lacking that resource in terms of evidence-based research to back up their strategies. Well, I've been a trustee for about 13 years with IPR, and I think what I value most is that the group uh, is great at, at spotting trends, uh, and not only you know what's going on new in the world and how it affects communications, but practical applications of that. So I learn both what's coming next and how to implement it. I think the work that they publish, they're very forward thinking, and the, the research is really important for people to look at to really shape and mold their, the way they do public relations. And I think it's great to bring the group of experts together on the board of IPR to really help the industry as a whole. It's just been great to connect with colleagues that go through similar experiences. You know, we're all sort of high up in our, in our industry and I think learning from each other and sharing information, best practices and working together to further the industry is really exciting. I got involved with IPR because I really believe in its mission and I believe in the importance of, of the science and the art behind public relations. Uh, together, that's how we have an impact. IPR is extremely important to the profession, and the reason is that it's really about, it's not just the art of public relations, it's the science beneath public relations. There's a whole discipline to understanding public relations, doing it well, and that's what IPR brings to the profession.